Hello guys, I'm here again. I have a bag here which is the um, authentic Louis Vuitton uh, denim or neo denim uh, shoulder bag. Here, this is an authentic one, of course. And um, this size of this is just uh, between medium and small size. And um, I'll show you why this is authentic. Um, first, I'll show you the, the print. You know, um, it should be like, for example, in this part right here, the LV uh, print, it should be also on the other side. It should be symmetrical, as you can see. And also the other side right here in this part, right here and this. And as well as if, uh, you know, it's an alignment as well, it should be straight line. You know, and also it must be straight line, not just like all over the place. Like for example, this one is LV right here. Um, it should be, uh, you know, if it's LV right there. It should be at the bottom or should be a line up the other side across. Okay. And also the stars you can see or the flowers, you know, if it's like, like this LV, there's a flower, then it's LV, and then a flower. So alternate. And also, if the flower is right there, it should be over there. So you can see right here, it should be over there. I have that right there, so it's right there. So you can see. And also, the leather should be a soft to touch. It is not kind of like um, uh, stiff, you know, because I know the fake one are stiff. I know. And also, over time, the Vachetta leather would be um, uh, turned into honey patina. Or, um, you know, but this one is having used much. So that's why it's still uh, really in excellent condition. As you can see, you know, having used much. So, but over time, once it's used, it turned into... Uh, orangey, uh, um, sorry, it turned into honey patina color. So that's how indication of uh, authentic Louis Vuitton Vachetta leather. And also, this one has a zipper. You can see. And, and also make sure the stamping of the, the uh, brass it should be look like this. I don't know if you can see it clearly, but this is how it look like. Mm. Let me see. I'm trying to, I want you to, you know, try to see it. Uh, it's hard to see this. Should be look like this. Well. It's hard to get it or trying to just uh all right anyway so this is authentic of course and make sure it's shiny enough and you know it's smart kind of nice to touch as well because i know the fake one it's kind of you know the you know the stamping of the or engrave of the the it's uh louis vuitton is uh, you can tell the difference be if it's fake or not it's because the letters the stamping is like smudging you know or it's not well stamped so and also the right here it should there's a stamp louis vuitton as well and there's like a buckle right here and actually you can adjust this oh wow you can actually take this off like for example if you have a long strap of this you can actually use this as crossbody bag if you have a long strap of this leather because it's adjustable and you can even take it off you can see right here and also the other side you can take it off so also that uh 
the stitching also outside as you can see nearby the zipper is actually double uh there are two one two and also on the other side one and two and also the pocket of the what is the brass you have to look also the right here the indication if it's authentic or not it has actually point uh the screw is has uh one two uh, three four five there are six point stars right here this one right here the screw because i heard a fake one there are only four you know and um but most uh, as what i've seen the authentic one has six stars or point six point stars right here or six points plus there's six of them i don't know if you can see it clearly mm. right here guys okay and the engraving as well is look like this hope you can see that well or yeah, it's hard to see when to focus in this one it's kind of small engraving plus it's also on the brass anyway the brass here is very shiny nice to touch and smooth you know it's like just smooth like nice to touch you can really feel it you can really know if it's expensive or not because of the the feel and touch of it it's just gonna you know plus there's some indication that uh if it's real or not and the front right here and a zipper right here one pocket right here it's actually nice and and deep right here okay not so deep but it's just kind of nice to put your maybe your phone or something small items you know and this one has eight cards a uh, baggy PM, the size of it is a PM, small size. Well, for me, it's not so small. Actually, it's just kind of like a standard small size, I guess, I would say. And cowhide leather. And has a card. How to take in care of the, you know, three pieces. As you can see, and of course there is also another uh, zipper pull right here and also in the middle of course the main um, zipper right here it has one and also the pocket part right here okay so anyway um let's continue right here to show right here the, the print so also as you can see that uh right here um so right here it should be right on the other side as well as you can see and this side you know so should that's an indication that uh authentic as well as on the other side okay uh, to look up too if it's like there it should be right there not just like if it's right there it's not like over there it should, it should be like facing towards each other and right there as well you know and also um, you can see at the back as well. So the, um, what is that? Uh, the print. So you can see the lineup, you know. So for example, that um, it's right here. Should be lined up over there. Or the flower should be lined up over there going down below. And if it's... Uh, so it's like for example right here should be alternate it's like lv flower lb flower lv flower so you can line up so and also like you know the flowers over there going there and should be you know um a line up as well the next one so you can see here so um let me show you in the uh inside now um well and also i'll show you the stamp there's just one thing also that you have to look when it's authentic or not. And you have to pay attention the the stamping. Okay? So, as you can see, the letter O. Um, as you can see, the letter O. Um... Right here, the letter O must be a uh, circle and not oval. Just pay attention to that. Make sure it's uh, really look like look like an O. This is actually ma made in USA. 
okay and uh, pay attention also to the r a and p and the s you know and mostly i pay attention to the o and n we need the n is kind of more wider uh when it's authentic the fake one i see uh mostly kind of look skinny so the why this is wider so uh of course that's what i mostly look but and make sure the r right here on top you know the original sign the r uh or uh stamping make sure it's not big because uh, mostly the big ones are actually fake i don't know that's that's what i noticed or ha i have seen so um this one of course look like kind of small that's how it is i don't know but that's how i look up uh, if it's fake or not and also make sure also the lining it is a suede so it is made from animal skin which is it's hard to replicate and also um uh, because i know the fake one is made of cloth it's more very hairy the fake one and the authentic one as you can just feel the suede in this you know it's how it look like and the touch as well it's more soft like the fake it's more hairy you know like i don't know i'm seeing a hairy one so but this is the one actually the authentic one this is how it look like the stamping and also the lining okay so next uh this one actually has only one pocket inside okay only one pocket and also i'll show you where you can find the dip code okay so mostly it is in the pocket okay it is in the pocket in this type of bag so you can see this one so what happened um it's just in the pocket the um the date code you can just it is along the seam right here so you're just gonna open it up like that it's on the side along the stitching part so as I can see, the deep code is over here. Sometimes, you know, some are faded actually because if it's suede, sometimes it fades the deep code, you know, especially the old ones, as I know of. Um, this one, there's a deep code right here. I don't know if you can see that well, but there's a deep code here, which read, um, uh, it's D00... Um, sometimes it's hard to read, guys. Is D zero zero? Um, what is this? I think it's like six six. I think. So that means uh, is D zero zero six six? So that means it's um. Oh no, hold on. It's a twenty six. Sorry, it's zero. Is D zero zero two six? So that means it's a second week of uh, second week of uh, two thousand six. So because the the two letters is indication of where it made from, which is is D is from USA. Zero zero is the uh, what is it? Zero zero six six is a the month and the week. So it reads a uh, second week of two thousand six okay and that's how the authentic look like and also let me show you this in uh inside of this that's how it is look like inside okay you can see the front that's how it is this is the two pockets right here and you just kind of do like that see <clears throat> excuse me um this one um actually it's well it's kind of baggy you know i mean as you can see that it will get slouched you know like that so that's it gonna be look like and also um it's kind of now this is not really so big so i'll show you how it look like when it's uh worn so right here you can see so it look like okay but I think I um I think this is really durable. It will last for a long time. It's because how it made, plus it is actually thick uh, denim, you know. 
thick and inside is leather you know and plus the the handle is thick and very nice and it's leather of course and also it has feet as you can see it has feet in it right here so right here and it has also stamping or engraving at the bottom the, or on the feet it says louis vuitton okay and this is leather you know so it has like stitching right here so um i think that's all for now guys and thanks for watching i hope you learned something um, in this video uh, if you want to see more video later please like comments or subscribe thanks for watching bye bye now all right okay bye bye